Hey, you made it. Thanks for thanks for popping through and coming through to the right place. This is the this is where you'll find all my X-rated content, nipples out and vapor out. Just kidding. I'm not gonna ever pull my nipples out uh, unless we do like a swimming pool video. And I can't ever imagine doing a slim swimming pool party with my shirt off in video. Just not that guy. It's not that guy. Uh, keep that shit on Twitch. Uh, for now, on 420 Vape Zone, though, we're going to switch to the camera with the Mighty Plus. We're going to turn this thing on because it's time to get some vapor going. I need, need to switch this to Fahrenheit. There we go. So, according to everything now, we have a boost temperature and a triple boost temperature. Woo! That's pretty cool. So, it functions like the Crafty now. So it, uh, you can set a boost temperature, you can set a, a triple boost temperature. Uh, that's, that's pretty freaking neat. That's pretty freaking neat. You, you should probably include that in the other video because I, I didn't do that in the other video. But let's go ahead and load a bowl here with... This video is sponsored by the Brilliant Cut Grinder. The Brilliant Cut Grinder, available at Grinders for Life. The three-piece gem cut grinder that turns as smooth as butter regardless of how dirty you use it. How dirty you keep it i've pushed pounds through my brilliant cut grinder and i can still turn it with with one finger i can still open it with one hand it's the the threadless grinder that never gums up and never loses performance regardless of how dirty you get it you may get it so dirty that you can actually feel that it's dirty but it'll still turn really easy and it'll still grind your weed just fine uh, it is the best grinder experience i've ever had and I've had a lot of grinders. I have over a hundred grinders back here on my shelf. And the Brilliant Cut Grinder is by far my favorite. And I came to that opinion well before they sponsored my YouTube channel. Here's what we loaded in here. Not a big amount. I didn't pack it in there. I just filled the, filled the bowl, filled the cavity up. I'm going to put the cooling unit on and turn the device on. I don't want to vape at... 356 though, I'm going to vape at uh, 383. 383 sounds, sounds better. Maybe 385. Let's do 385. And uh, we're already at 200. Uh, our, our countdown for our, or our count up, I guess, for our, our heat up timer is going to be skewed because I, I preheated it while I was talking earlier when I was fucking around with the crafty uh, heating scales with the three different uh, presets. So our, our heat up is un unfortunately our heat up is unfortunately going to be uh, salty data, no data from the, the heat up. But I think it does heat up a little faster than the OG Mighty. Like it heats up in like a minute versus a minute thirty. We are at temperature. Let's take our first hit of the Mighty Plus. Leaving this hit in so you can see and kind of hear the intensity. I'll talk real quiet that way. My my voiceover voice doesn't fuck up the the airflow, but I'm hitting hard. I'm inhaling hard, direct to lung, trying to fill my lungs up with vapor. That's what I do with this vape. Delicious. I don't have any uh, sense of, of like a plastic taste or any new vape taste. I don't get any of that uh, that new sneaker smell or new new vape taste that robot farts may smell that a lot of uh, new vaporizers have fresh from the factory. I didn't do any burn offs. I didn't do any wipeouts whatsoever. Temperature drops about 12 degrees as I'm hitting it, which is about average. It's, it's about what the the Mighty does, depending on the temperature that it's at and uh, how hard I hit it, you know. It's delicious. Smooth vapor, as to be expected. I don't know that I can taste any difference between the ceramic coated bowl and the aluminum bowl. Uh, I'm going to raise the temperature to maximum. I'm going to vape at 410, which is what I'm used to vaping at. I, I usually vape at 410 in my regular Mighty. Like if I turn my regular Mighty on, it's already set to 410. In fact, we might as well... Oh shit, I need to put a screen back in here. There, I'm tasting a little vape signature that I, I don't think would normally be there. Maybe it's because it's new. 
maybe uh, it's just uh, because it's clean. You know, it's hard telling because remember my old vape is pretty fucking foul. My uh, old mighty is pretty nasty looking. So it, I may just be getting a clean vape taste instead of a hey, that's a it's like a new vape. I don't know, but I am tasting a different signature than I'm than I'm used to with the mighty. You know, maybe like a new mighty taste. Fill the second lung as well there. So this bowl pretty much tastes spent already, and I think I'm ready to reload it. Uh, but I'll I'll give it another hit. Look at it. Look at four, eight, four, nineteen. One more. Come on. Ah. Uh. We could have had a legit four twenty. On the on the mighty plus. Yeah, this bowl is dead. This bowl is cooked. This bowl is spent. Uh, I'm gonna dump it out. It's a nice loose pack. Weekly the bowler is already already full. Let's let's load a fresh one here. Oh, it reset back to its first temperature. Wild. So because because I'm using the booster mode, rather than changing the temperatures, uh, it after 90 seconds of, of not vaping, it resets back to the 356 temperature. That's actually a pretty cool little interface change there. Uh, because now now if I leave it at 356 and I forget about a bowl, it's, uh, it's cooking it less than it would. If I, oh, there we go. See, three, three clicks right back to 410. Perfect, which is what I want to be vaping at. I want to, I want to vape at 410. I want to put my screen back in my old Mighty. So I can do some comparisons. But first, 410, cheers. both lungs again both lungs Ooh, man who are we climbing up climbing up 419 420 we got a real 420 we got a real 420 on the mighty we really did it <laughs> so happy the new mighty finally goes to 420 kind of finally goes to 420 good shit good shit So I've been hitting the Crafty Plus for a couple days now, and I was actually thinking that the Crafty Plus, the new Crafty Plus, is actually a little bit softer than the old Crafty Plus. And I was kind of worried that the new Mighty, the Mighty Plus, was going to come along here and be a little softer than the old Mighty. That was my concern. That was my concern going into this. I don't think so anymore. I don't think so anymore. I think this thing is doing just fine. Just fine. Yeah, I can't say that I taste any thing different now. Like in the last bowl when I first turned it up to 410, it started to taste a little uh I, I, I'm really reluctant to, to call it like a new vape taste. And it's what it was. But it was so subtle. It was so subtle. You know how like melon tastes are subtle compared to like other fruits? The 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 taste impact that I tasted that I tasted from the Mighty Plus was like a melon comparatively in terms of like how it tastes compared to other 
new vape smells and tastes. Sure know what I mean? Sure know what I mean? That makes sense. The melon, the melon metaphor, simile, whatever, whatever is grammatically, semantically correct. I never, I never remember the difference between similes and metaphors. I'm vaping on some sativa tonight. Gelato sativa, homegrown, homegrown gelato. And I have some new grows going, so please uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you're not already. Or uh, subscribe to the browser notification since you're here on 420vapezone.com now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for watching on my website so much. YouTube is fucking me, man. YouTube is all like, thou shall not vaporize. But uh, meanwhile, like... Dope is Yola, like, has, like, millions of, of fucking subscribers, and his fucking videos are all, all up in, like, the recommendation lists, and they're not age-restricted or anything, and, and, uh, I'm over here, like, getting deleted for, for using vapes. Because vapes are bad! Vape! Bad! Damn. Alright. We got our screen back in our mighty... I wanna vape, I wanna vape some comparison bowls now. I want to vape some comparison bowls. See how this uh, this comes out. Two Fist Thursday, maybe. Two Fist Thursday. Can we do a Two Fist Thursday Mighty Plus versus Mighty? Hmm. Thanks again for watching. You can find me streaming every Friday night, 6 p.m. Pacific, with my friend Jerry. Jerry's got shelves like these behind him, and uh, he's got like. 300 vapes as well, so we got, a, we got a lot of vapes and we got a lot of stuff to talk about. We have a, a good time talking vapes and talking life and talking bullshit every Friday night. And then uh, there's a bunch of videos on the on the Think Tank channel as well. We package up our interesting shit into little little clips. So go check it out on the Troy and Jerry Think Tank channel. There's a link up here. Nope, over here, right here. What up? Right there. Uh, make sure the video editor who who edits this one. What's that uh, thing up there when they upload it? It's a card. Thanks for that. You can leave this in there too, because hey, here's Troy. If you're on Instagram, I'm 420 underscore vape zone. Uh, I had to get the underscore in there because Instagram deleted me, picked me out for weed or vapes or something. Oh, it's something. Oh, it's something. Uh, I am on Twitch. We stream on Twitch. And uh, I'm on Discord, so if, if you're if you're if you want to sesh with some with some of the 420 vape zone community, you can join the the Discord. We're a, a relatively small and, and humble community. We're we're friendly, and we like to to vape and play video games with each other in the in the Discord and talk vapes and talk about other stuff as well. It's a no toxicity zone though as well, so we try to maintain. Uh, a vibe in the community in the in the sessions so please please try to maintain and be aware of the vibe come in and see what the vibe is and and try to to fit in the vibe if you're joining the the discord sessions and uh, that's it thanks for watching please use the the links here again it really helps to support the channel and uh bye bye again since i didn't click stop yet by the third time.